Hello everybody and welcome back to Dungrid Where we are playing the cutest game ever made in the history of life with the cutest music you've ever heard And the cutest sense of all cuteness And without further ado, let's get into it We want to speak to Haken We've got a free ring of speed, which is pretty good actually Speak to the shop owner We can buy a charm of madness, a main gauche I never understood how that works, but I mean it's probably good. Uh, steel boots is really good for us early game. Let's uh, let's buy steel boots and see how that works out for us. Try something a bit different from the from the norm. Never gonna take damage from spikes. That could come in extremely handy for us at some point in the game. So I just did a run off camera for funsies just to get back into the swing of things. On my first uh, attempt, I was very lucky to uh, get the crossbow. So obviously I had a pretty good run. I can just this. Da -da 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 you bitches don't stand a chance. I've got a secret weapon. The spike boots to make me take zero damage from uh, enemies. Also, I'm able to get all the gold here, which is actually kind of useful. Anyway, what I was trying to say is that um, I got the... Um, can crossbows. So, obviously, I made it to Niflheim. I took super a lot of damage on the final floor. If I didn't take out damage, I might have made it because I used all my... Money, all my money, to f all my satiety. Well, not my money, because money wasn't a problem. The satiety was the problem. Oh, I took damage. Fuck. I mean, I, I can be. I don't have to worry. Cause I've got immunity from spikes. It's actually so good. Um, it's actually so much better than you think. Anyway, and uh, I just took a lot of damage. So I had to use all my money to buy heals, which kind of put me in a bad situation because I unfortunately didn't get this to the chance to be able to. Uh, Oh, 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 I think that was actually pretty bad, except that one shot we took, I think we did very well there. Um, almost dodged that last shot too, so I still haven't found a way to make spears work for me, so I'm still not going to use spears in in minds, but maybe one day. Anyway, so I was doing, I think I actually had like a very good run going, I had like a 200 HP because I just never took damage in the first floor, and the second, most of the second floor, uh, first part, and then I had like a shield that I, then I put the, the mask of madness on, and the mask of madness actually put me in a situation where I was... I was actually um, on like 120 HP because I uh, uh, took away my HP, but of course gave me a fudge ton of power. I was doing 120% damage with a strike on my crossbow, and I had an okay crit rate. Not the greatest crit rate, but an okay crit rate, and that was allowing me with the hand crossbow to uh, kill the enemies reasonably fast. Have I been through here? Yes, I have. Okay. I get lost though in this game. I play it for as many games as I want. And uh, it will never change the fact that I still get lost. I took straight up or hit there. Just have nothing to say about that. But I just not have any weapons. I do. It's shitty crossbow. But it's shitty. Uh, not even a shitty crossbow. Just a shitty bow. Uh, cotton uh, cloth armor is okay, but it's not great. Okay, now I need to see where we are. Okay, so we are going the right way. And uh, yeah, so I, I would like to pick up a new weapon. That would be great because at the moment I'm kind of oh hello. Uh, boomerang is okay. I might take boomerang. Matchlock gun is actually is grown on me. I had oh my word. I had a oh my word. I had a run where I uh, had the match lock thing and it was actually working out pretty well. This is a good area to get lots of HP back, so we don't take any damage here. We will be good. We unfortunately took damage immediately, so there goes that stream. But I mean, actually, we did gain quite a lot. Of, I don't want the bomb bag really. I'm gonna just take a, okay, it's not equipped anyway. Ah, uh, what do we have on? That's good. That's okay. This is probably the, um, I don't know. Like, I actually like what I've got on right now. I will distribute this and this and uh, this. Be fun. Why not? I still don't know what can happen when we get that tribute to the max, but one day, one day is one day we will do it. And uh, when we do, we will then have definitely good ideas. So, right now, if you're looking at our stats, we don't have much power bonus. Um, we have a lot of HP. Let's try going for a tank build. Let's try this for change. So we buy the defensive items and then we'll go for a tank build instead of a defensive build. So last time I bought all the attack, all the um, damage items, like all the damage. So I bought all the tomato soup and uh, it gave us, of course, a lot of uh, damage. But now I'm going to buy all the onion soup, get a lot of defense up. See how that uh, implements. Because I'm very bad at dodging stuff, as you all know. So. I should probably focus my runs on taking as little damage as possible and that way I can just tank it up kind of like a nice tank roll in uh, Dark Souls so we are taking very little damage so if we look at this 21 defense we are taking very little damage right now I, I hit like 10 times in this run alone 
And I... Oh my goodness. Well, that was a good example to see how much damage we really take. I got hit like 10 times there alone and... Uh, I don't know why I was playing like an idiot and taking unnecessary amounts of damage, but I was. So that's the problem. But uh, hopefully, I'll solve that problem right now. The match the matchlock gun, which I was just talking about a few seconds ago. But I have steel boots. Does that stop those spikes too? I assume so. Just Tuggies. Just Tuggies. Nothing I ain't handled before. So, oh, there's our hand crossbow. There we go. Okay, so we have a very good chance of making this run. But I've gone defensive and I haven't got any damage. And I'm a bit worried since I didn't go damage that the uh, hand crossbow is not going to be as good. Because the hand crossbow's uh, big thing is that it lacks in damage. So I am worried about that. Because uh, if you're doing, if you're not doing damage to hand crossbow, it's a problem. I could change up the builder. Ooh, another ring of necklace. That's gonna help for our tank build. We'll think about that later on. The hand crossbow is just too good for me to pass up on. Like I can't, I can't imagine a world where I would ever not use the hand crossbow. It's like if not using, all I'm doing by not using the hand crossbow is I'm nerfing myself. I'm saying like, oh, you know what? You could win this run easily, but let's rather. Struggle my butt off and uh, not win the one easy by just using the hand crossbow because I want to be like a manly man or some bullshit like that. Alright, I don't want to take the damage from spikes, so we can just relax, take this slowly, get this item. It's a slingshot, that sucks. Forgot that that woman does. Uh, I, I actually like dodged it and then ran into it like it is. So I only have myself to blame for that. But what can I say? She has some kind of mental hold of me whenever I see her I just become idiotic and uh, take dumb damage thought I saw money here I did see money here okay cool I just want to see if there's some form of like secrets you can maybe use bomb bag to like break down walls of some kind that would be pretty cool but I think I need to start watching other streamers play the game to uh, figure that out because I'm not really good with finding secret stuff I'm called more kind of like I'm the old school gamer you know I'm the, I'm the guy that will go and he'll play the game for 6,000 hours grinding out them levels baby you know what I'm saying so I'm all about that life you know Anyway, we want HP up, which we can and get this. Thank you. So, I like, I like to just buy lots of HP up right now and then either go power defense. I did go defense here, so I'm going to keep going for defense for now. Because I find it is kind of pointless for us to uh, not. I think steel boots we can get rid of now because there isn't. I mean, there is spikes in the second floor, I guess. Chainmog is 8 armors, gives 10 max health. I think, like, I don't know. It's, I think, like, I think, like, this is worse. Actually, so and uh, we're never gonna put the speed thing on, so let's just try tribute all of those. That's a nice big tribute right there. I think max HP since we are upping our HP percentage based bonuses will be worth more, probably. That's at least the hope I'm going for. I have no way, of course, knowing if I'm correct or wrong or what, but uh, that's what I'm gonna go for. Ooh, you wanna get bats into that bitch? I don't think just because I have a crossbow, I'm not gonna use my other weapon. I got other weapons, baby. I got other weapons. I ain't got other weapons, I ain't afraid to use it. Hello. You should have moved, dude. You cannot just stand still. Okay, first step done. Second step, doggies. Third step, get the baton out. Oh, crap, that's not. That is doggies, but that's not what I was planning. The hand crossbow is, is definitely my number one favorite uh, weapon in this game. I do want to still see what's, if there's a floor or boss or whatever the hell. If there's just, I just want to know if there's anything pretty much behind the... Uh, I want to see if I Do I have satiety? What is that? 30? I have 30 satiety. Maybe I can get something like a crit bonus or something. Uh, this gives me power. It's 40 so we can't have that. Evasions, okay. Crit is okay. You know, I think we just don't take anything. Keep the low safety for the next floor, and then we can on the next floor just buy more max HP. Max HP and armor, like that's what I'm just gonna go for. Oh, wait, this is a boss now. Maybe I should have healed up. Please give me a heal, just one heal, just one heal. Nope, okay. Since we do not have a heal, so this might be a little bit difficult. Um, we don't have another. 
anything to summon. But if we don't take too much damage to Bilal, we can do 99 HP is like more than I had when I started the game, so. Those were fast, dude. Bilal is actually so easy once you like fight him like 10 times. That's why I'm, I, I beat him easily. Like, we only took 22 damage. But that's because, like, we took, like, four hits. So, the armor is definitely, definitely playing an effect. And I think, like, that's definitely where I should focus my my stuff at. Just getting... Ooh, Charm of Power. You know, Charm of Madness, which gives me 8 power for nothing, is going to get replaced by 20 power with minus 10% max HP. Now, the thing is, the problem with that is now you're saying, oh, but while well, using your HP... You're using your, you're upping your HP with the food. Why don't you just up your power then? I don't know. That's the thing. I haven't done the maths yet. I don't know which one's better. Is it better to? Oh, nice shot, dude. Oh, double nice shot, dude. I only take, I've taken two hits and I'm taking ten damage. That's not too bad. Remember, the ice stuff do hit harder. So, I haven't done the maths yet to know if max H, the amount of max HP you lose from the time of madness is less or more than the amount of. How are we getting from it? So like, which one beats which one? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh my god, dude, I thought you were not that. I thought you were a doggy, bitch. Oh, Shamsha. I haven't seen a Shamsha in so long, actually. Shamsha was my original boy, you know? Remember, guys, when I used to Shamsha up in here? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck is your problem, dude? No, oh, bad. don't you shoot me. Oh, are you kidding? I just jumped right into the bat bullet. Okay, well, let's hand in my gaming card right now, guys. I just jumped right into the black bullet, so that's a problem. So we want to look for possibly more defense here and more max HP. That's what we want from our female. So let's go for the defense first with the onion soup. And that's what we always take for now. Get ourselves kicked to over here. And go up. Uh, up this way, okay. Having triple dash and double jump is, of course, making my dodging capabilities... 6 billion times better, which is good. Stop giving me shitty weapons and give me good relics, for fuck's sake. Ah, no, ah, wait. Oh, we can't open because we're in battle, okay. Nope, you need to die, 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 you need to die. Oh, 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 oh. Bitch. Bitch. Okay. We do still have steel boots on. Okay. I wasn't sure if we still have steel boots was a problem. I'm glad we do because the spiky areas in this uh, this floor do suck a lot. So it's going to save me a little bit of time, I guess. But uh, yeah, I wasn't sure that's the problem. If you're not sure, while they play it safe is all I have on saying. Ooh, nice little ultra fast over here. I'll trip it some shame. I'll trip it this too. Trip it a little, baby. I don't know what that does, but whatever. We should probably be selling it for money to buy better stuff with, but uh, yeah, I made my choice. I made my choice, and my choice is to go for the full maxing of the tribute shrine as fast as possible. Uh, we do not want to accidentally go through the like we did the other game. Remember the other game, guys? We accidentally went right through the freaking place. What's up, dude? What do you got for me? Nothing. Okay. I am starting to find that like um, he's pointless because like I've never actually found myself in a situation where I'm like oh yes finally I get to you and you can now give me something I need it's more like oh crap it's more like if we get something yay bonus but usually we don't care it's kind of the it's kind of the situation we're having when we're playing as like yeah, I love this this is fun hello 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 come again next millennium. Nope. I'm too good at this game now. I'm not really too good at this game now. I'm not even close to too good at this game. But one day I will be too good at this game. And then it'll be exciting. Okay, looking at the floor. I still have more places to go. So let's get our butts over there. Lots of times I find myself in a situation where I'm like, maybe I shouldn't have, like, Gone on, I should have just left the stage because I'm on full HP. Oh crap. Well, okay, you know what? Well done. Well fucking done, dude. Oh my goodness. This 
See, because we just took like more eight, more damage in this one room than we took in the entirety of the floor. And now I'm like, well, the little bit of money I got for that, and the one item I got, which is a matchstick, which is not even that good, was it worth it? No, it actually just wasn't. But we do get a second room, so maybe this second room can make up for it. That is at least the hope. Can I? No. Maybe we had that other item I could do. You can fucking shoot downwards? I think that's some bullshit, dude. Bring it on, doggy. Bring it on. I ain't scared of no doggy. Yeah, this does look like a dead end, though. So, we basically just came with, like, what? Like, 100 gold max? We came with, like, 100 gold, and then we just fucking lost half our HP gauge. So, that was not worth it. Like, anyway, look at it, it's not worth it. But what it does do is it does let us, um... It does let us... Eat a bit of our satiety up, which takes us... To a place we might be able to buy some stuff so we probably want to buy we bought the defense item so let's buy the hp item it's only 11 which is actually not that good considering there's sometimes ones that give 16 etc but uh it's fine we might be at like a, at, we might be able to get to, i still have spike boots right yeah, okay uh, we might be able to get like a hundred and um you need to go first dude oh. Um, we might be able to get to a point with like 160, 170 HP and then we can just kind of like tank all the damage. Especially since we're sitting with quite a bit of armor on ourselves. We will try and change up our accessories maybe for the boss. That's something I don't actually do often. The accessories I use for the bosses and the accessories I use for the enemies I'm fighting are always the same. And that's actually very bad because the enemies are not the same. And that is something one has to keep in mind when playing this game. Normal enemies and bosses have different requirements, different things and thus you need to have i should be equipping different items uh, appropriately so like on a boss i don't need stuff like maybe the blood lust ring because i can't really heal up so because i'm not gonna be killing any single singular enemies so maybe equipping like the one that gave me four armor instead or one armor even it's this is not even strictly it's just straight up better so that's little things to keep in mind uh i like sword of vines i do Alter. I will tribute all of these. We almost got the altar halfway now, which is actually kind of cool. Oh, that was just a waste of jumping and dashing. So having three dash bars is like, it's like my whole life is, my whole life has changed, you know? My eyes have been opened. And... No, this is some bullshit. That was some bull fucking shit. I had no way to go, nothing to do. Asshole. Fuck! That happens every time on this floor. Before and if I might end up taking like a trillion damage and I have to use all my bloody money to heal up instead of using all my money to just get like in a happier situation. I'm not taking damage. I took damage. I took two hits damage because I jumped into a fucking ghost. This happens every single time on this floor. I do really, 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 really well. And I get to this floor and then suddenly I start taking like infinite damage. Need to like angle this exactly right. Oh, I misplayed that big... Oh, that heals huge though. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have to now use all our freaking Sate AT to... Oh, I hate this part. Whoop. It's like a little jump you have to do. It's like not difficult to do, but it's like a little bit of a timing jump. Oh man, this sucks. We have to go back there. And if I don't time it right, I'm gonna take extra ten damage. Okay, the only hope we have now is that our little uh, we missed it. Oh, fuck! It literally was ten damage. Too. Um, is that our defense is so high that we just can tank all the damage from their farm without going game over? Man, that's irritating. That is so irritating. I'm so frustrated. But, I mean, it's gonna happen from time to time. Oh, that heal is huge. Boop. Maybe we just play really well and we take normal damage from this point onwards. We might be able to, to like cheese the system. Okay, fuck your son. We did get a HP out of that silver ring. I don't even know what the fuck a silver ring is. Just max HP and uh, more power. I mean. Makes me want to consider equipping that over the 
Okay, so let's not do be hasty about this. Let's first explore the floor and then we'll decide how we want to do it later on. I know how much HP I I need at least like 140 to beat Nephilim, especially since I've got way less power. So I'm gonna need to heal here. Fudge me. Okay, so we've got how much? Like 40? We've got exactly 40. We could go for more defense. What is our defense currently sitting at, by the way? 18. Yeah, we, we took up the other defensive item. Maybe that was a bad idea, actually. We go. Uh, man. What's our power at? 50% bonus power. So we're very, very weak. Hey, we're very weak. So, is there anything you just give me for 20? Like, is there a 20 boy? Is there a 20? There's a 20 boy. Fried egg. I do not need fried egg. Is there another 20 boy, maybe? 20. Seasonal bird. Crit damage rate. I mean, that's not great. Dash damage is not great. Yeah, all of these just suck for me, kind of. So, I guess you just go for the full up heals. So, this is 30, this is 20, and this is 15. So, I think you have these two. Because that will give you slightly more benefit in the long run. Okay, well, let's go fight this time. We have 120 HP. We don't hit very hard. Um, unfortunately, but the only positive we do have boss is that uh, I'm slightly better at the game. Oh, wait, no. Mm, I wanted to take Blood Ring off because Blood Ring does nothing as if I'm. See, I wanted to take Blood Ring off and put the. I actually just took too much damage there. Way too much damage there. I, I dodged okay, that was pretty... That wasn't bad dodging. Oh fuck, I forgot about that. That's one down, one down, one down, one down. Two down. Yes! Okay. Slightly better playing actually won me the fight against the Vine, which makes me a very happy man. Very happy man. It means I've actually got... A little bit better together. <laughs> Because I didn't have this. Oh my god, we got Steel Warhammer. Let's try it out. It's f it feels slower, but it seems to hit hard and also has a chance to stun. So I don't know why they show a little red dot here where Nephilim is. Can I like melt him if I had fire damage, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Is that a secret boss? Can you fight him a second time? I just don't know. The game won't tell me. Okay, so this is the forest area, which is always fun, as you all know. It's going to be very fun for me because, A, I've never done the forest area without having our OP fucking magic. Oh, it's Gladius. Oh, I kind of want to Gladius. Gladius has got a good combo situation going. But I don't know. We'll, see we'll come back to this. We'll come back to this. I want to use this. Oh. Okay, no. They're not working for me. Bitch, they made a freaking crossbow for a reason. Let's use it. But I shouldn't be trying to do fancy stuff or anything. I should just be playing to win. And that means I need to crossbow spam. Bitch, I'm gonna crossbow freaking spam. I have no shame when it comes to winning, baby. It's all about that win. Getting that little win under your belt, you know what I'm saying? Beating that third floor boss, which I actually don't know if I can beat. Oh, this is a bad situation. Oh, it's a very bad situation. You know why? Because everything I am fighting against can shoot a gun across the fucking screen. These bats on the on the jungle area are way better than the bats the previous. Ooh, that guy's a he's a fast boy. He's a fast boy. Okay, we did it somehow. I had no doubts in my mind. Bitch, please. I think I'm gonna fall for your little bat trick. You like a basic boy. You a basic boy, as they call them. There's the shield. I mean, we can have the shield with crossbow. I love the fact that the crossbow is one-handed. How is the crossbow this good and it's freaking still one-handed? I just don't understand. Oh my god. I think I actually took a hit there. Uh, excuse me. Oh, shit. 
I kind of forgot about that situation. I kind of forgot. How do I beat you? Oh, maybe a melee, melee boys. Nope, not melee boys. Range boys. Okay, so he's just hide the fence. There's nothing you can do about that because there's no like. But he doesn't really have. He can't really hit you, so it's like a good balance. He can't hit you, but it takes you a fuck ton of time to kill him. No, the boys with the freaking range are the problem. The boys with the range gotta go first. It's all about prioritizing. You need to know which enemy is prioritized. Like that guy on the bottom, he means nothing. The range boys, they a problem. Bats, not a problem. Range boys, problem. Snake, no problem. Easy. <gasps> no poison water problem. I hate that when you dash and your thing is pointed slightly down, you go through with levers, even though you didn't want to or intend to. I think we took 10 damage from that. I'm not even kidding. So that's one little misclick. 10 damage. How much damage is 10 damage in this game? It's the difference between winning or losing the freaking game. Hello, Cocker Boy. I know you got a Gladys for me, and I do. I am, I am slightly interested in Gladys. I'm not gonna lie to you. But at the same time, I'm interested in winning what? Oh, beautiful free heals. Always taste very nice. Oh, boys. Are you a range boy or are you a mad boy? Is there a range boy or a mad boy? That's a range boy. Nope, that's a range boy and a mad boy. I've got a range boy and a mad boy on my boys. I'm not happy about that. What do we got here? Oh, it's a chainsaw. Oh, chainsaw, chainsaw. No. Chainsaw. Bitch. Fuck your shit, doggy. I wasn't even scared for one second. Oh, he goes through the chainsaw. That's cheating. That's cheating. He should take damage when he runs through the chainsaw. Take damage when you run through the chainsaw game. This is bullshit. The fuck is this unfair crap? Why do I not get any chests? Where have I chests at, baby? Well, I don't even. You can keep. Oh, make a deal. You keep the chest. Just. There's a siren. I took damage from siren immediately because that's what I do. Nope! I'm not taking damage to a fucking bat though. Not, not today. Not today. Okay, looking at the map. Okay. We haven't found. We haven't found food lady yet. And we are kind of hungry, so that's good. What are we gonna up? We're gonna up defense, uh, more defense, and more HP, I guess. We'll go defense and HP, and then we'll go defense and HP on the next floor again. Things like well, something along those lines. Enemies? No enemies? Just freebies? Enemies. I know there's enemies here. I don't even try. Oh, this is about out. Never mind. There's no enemies here. There's no enemies. It's a free world. Look, my natural instinct is to just jump, okay? My letter. Hello, my letter. I want to get another onion soup. And uh, we cannot eat a vegetable, I mean a pea soup, can we? No, okay, sweet. The onion soup is just so fattening, that's the problem. It's such a fattening meal. Um, I'm gonna keep this because I might need that. You know what we should do? We should go meet up with uh, Boichi. Coco, my boy Cock. See if he's got any good um, stuff for us to buy. I don't think he will, but you never know. Oh, Cock. You never know. Any... No, he doesn't like that. That's what I thought, but you know, while they're safe and sorry, as they say. So this episode's only 28 minutes in and we're like already on the third area. So I'm actually very proud of the speed at what I went here. Um, yes, like the argument can still be made, no doubt, that I'm using the hang crossbow. So I should have zero reason to be proud of myself. But fuck you, game. I'm still proud of myself. Snake it. Snake it. Boom. I'm not going into the water. This... Oh wait, you know, we can take the steel gauntlets off and put the ring on simply because the steel gauntlets does give us a tiny bit of defense, but... Oh, no, that's boikies I don't want to deal with right now. Nope, 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 nope. I need to find the range boiki and I need to kill the range boiki. The range boiki has to go down. Okay, range boiki is down. Now we kill the big boiki and then we clear out the shield boiki and it's easy, 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 easy. That will, I think we handled that amazingly well. Amazingly well. Like, ooh, the Muramasa. That's a good weapon. It's, not as, it's obviously not as good as the uh, hand crossbow, but it's still, it's still good. Bitch, 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 bitch. Nope, I want the hand crossbow. <laughs> I didn't even realize I was not using the hand crossbow until I was almost like dead. But uh, at least I figured out, and that's, you know, in the long run. Oh my word, this little boy, he's like, he's a, he's a beast. He acted like he was nothing. He acted like he wasn't tough. He acted like he wasn't a man, man. But he was. He might not look at him. But don't judge a man by the cover of his armor. I know he has no armor, but that's exactly what I'm trying to say. He had no armor, so he looked like a weakling. He looked like something 
we did not need to worry about something that could be trifled with. But I learned the hard way that that was not indeed the case. Look, because okay, so there's always that one flank room before the exit room. So we know we're fighting the boss if we go through this. So I don't want to go through that. So we first want to explore the rest of this room. Kill as much of these boy kids as possible without taking damage. Oh my nice throw, dude. I'm actually so mad at the same time. I'm so impressed at the same time. Oh, this is not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. That was not part of the plan. That was not part of the plan. Just shoot everywhere. Just shoot in every direction and pray. Every direction and pray. Every direction and pray. You motherfucking boiches. Little crossbow boiches are making a big scene. You fuckers. Luckily, I've got a lot of armor, apparently. Okay, so that was a bit scary. So many boy keys in that room. Did you guys see that shit? Oh, how is one even supposed to deal with that? I don't even know. I don't even know. Why are all these like trees sad? I'm just saying. Ooh, main goosh. Hey, block 20. Just straight up gives me 20 defense. Like, that's just so good. Does it just straight up give me 20 defense? Do I just have 41 defense? Yes, I do. Okay. Oh my god. Mr. Snake, you cannot sneak up on a good soul like <gasps> No, the little succubus ladies. I've never actually seen them do anything because they kept dying. I kind of want one to kiss me and see what happens. Because maybe they're nice. Maybe they're friendly. Are you a friendly succubus? She's winking at me. Winking all cute like. I don't know if she, I can't. I, I don't want to take damage because I'm doing okay. And I think I have a chance to win the run here. So I don't want to unnecess unnecessarily take damage here. But at the same time, evasion. I might be able. Yeah, I can put the evasion on over the. The ring of health. I mean, I doubt the evasion is gonna mean anything for us, like literally anything for us, but I'm still gonna go for it. Okay. I'm kind of sick. I think I'm kind of safe here. I'm like, no jokes, I think I'm safe here. I'm actually safe here. Oh my goodness, I'm not safe here. I was a lie. The safeness was a lie. The game lied to me. Oh my word. The lies. Ooh, watch out. That's gonna be great for the boss. Okay, have we explored inside this floor? No, we have not. We can go to our lady. Letter. Uh, we have some of the piece of. Yeah, now hopefully we'll be able to not tank too much damage here. And then what we can do is we can um, get a heal from her. Just one heal before we actually go on with the game. And that would be cool if we get one heal before we go on with the game. I am ready. I know you guys are here somewhere. Just bring it. Bring it. I'm ready for you. I'm ready for you. I'm ready. Okay. There's no one there. Three items. Okay. There we go. Oh, so close, but it's so far. Hello, Batsy boy. Is that a fucking spider? Where are you, Bat? You cannot hide in the corner. You know what this game reminds me of right now? Terraria. I don't know why, it just does. I like Toy. You guys want to see Toy play through my channel? I fucking enjoy the shit out of Toy. I would make a Toy play through no problem. Do I'm not, I'm very bad at it. Don't get me wrong, but I'll still do it. Oh health, health. That 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 makes this whole fucking journey worth it. Oh, and a monocle too. See, we're getting some good accessories to replace our shitty accessories. So before we fight the boss, we must. Oh, um, Ogre Boy! Cocker Boy! What's up? I almost forgot about you, dude. I haven't seen you so- I haven't used you in so long, because everything you sell is so shit. Uh, not that it's shit, it's just like, I have freaking crossbow, you know? Once you have the crossbow, everything else in the game just seems pointless. So, one more enemy kill and we're gonna get a heal of 10 HP, so we definitely wanna go through that. We definitely wanna do that. Any enemies? Just the free room. Giantest, freest room we've ever seen. Okay, so tribute that, tribute that. Uh, tribute to the Muramasa. Five crit evasion. Okay, we don't want that because that's better. Um, Monocog is five crit. This gives five evasion. This gives me power and HP. This gives me power and less HP. This gives me HP. So we might not want the HP. We've got so much HP. We just might want to get rid of the HP. So let's go like that. Get rid of the HP. Put the Monocle on. And, um, yeah, I think that's good. Then we'll replace the blood ring with the watcher when we, when we fight the boss. Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good. Okay. And if we look at this now, we've cleared out the hole. Let's go speak to our woman in the food area. We have an... Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know what I just did, but I'm sorry. And we want to get the whatever heal we can get, but I think it's only this heal. Yep, that was only that heal. Sweet. So we got 106 HP. We're going to fight the next boss. 
Uh, we must just let's just gonna change our uh, things out right now so I don't forget. I've got the watcher. We've got the we got forty two armor. This is the strongest we're ever gonna be. So let's go. Tunak. Let's go, Tunak. You know what makes Tunak hard? The fact that some fucking people fight him. He's too shit scared to fight me on his own. You too scared to fight me on oh, Tunak? Oh god, I'm getting I mean, stun locked into oblivion. Oh my god, I just got blown up into oblivion. Oh my god, I just got hit by traps. No, he's got traps. Tunak, you know that traps, traps and fucking peop so many people. That's got cool, dude. Fight me like a man. Fight me one v one like a man. You know, fight me like a like a giant lizard king man, like the real lizard king man shit. I'm just saying, what kind of shitty ass woman chicken picking chicken licking chicken are you? Too scared to fight me on your own. Too to, to fight me like a real man. Why well, am I'm, I'm scared, bitch? Oh, oh my goodness, I'm dead. Uh, uh, I think I'm doing a lot better this time than we did last time, though. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I, oh, we just took damage from something. I don't even know what took damage to me, but I'm gonna just say it's your it's cheats hacks hacks hacks. Hacks, hacks, hacks. Tunox hacking. Tunox using hacks. We only have 3 HP. Boop, boop. Tunox, I ain't scared. I ain't scared. Tunox, I believe. We still have a chance. We still have a chance, Tunox. I still believe in Tunox. I still believe. No. No. You're not giving me your stupid traps, little boy. Not today, Tunox. Not today, freaking Tunox. Not today, Tunox. No. 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 Yes. Yes. <laughs> we did it, guys. We fucking did it with 3 HP, we the world's greatest gamers there ever was in the history of life. Tunok defeated. Da -na 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 -na. I killed Tunok. I got Ali on and a new item appeared in the thing which is called Savage Axe. Damage 23 to 30 minus 30 dash damage, but attacks. Per attacks with zero point. Oh, it doesn't attack very fast. No one could possibly imagine that the lizard men would unite. Mm, you see? You see? No one imagined it, guys, but I beat it. And that's what I'm So we beat the third floor. I'm extremely excited about that. I'm going to end this episode and we're going to go to the uh, fourth floor next episode, which is probably a bad idea because I'm going to die like immediately on the fourth floor. And it's going to be the shortest episode ever. We're all, it's going to be two runs in one episode. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Dun Greed. If you guys enjoyed us kicking Tunak's butt, hit that like button. I think I played very well there at the end against Tunak, and I think I deserve some form of love from you guys. So send that love my way, and I'll be a very happy man. And I'll see you all in the next episode of Dungeon Greed where we hopefully make good progress in the fourth stage. Maybe even beat it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time.